Hey there, off Morgan's Costa Guard. Welcome to the OCG Fam Show to you, my YouTube buddies. Mmm, little pineapple juice today. Very tasty. What's going on? Let me know in the comments. We'll talk about it after the show. But right now, let's just get into the show. Uh, just a little short one here, I think. I wanted to bring this question up. Someone was uh, asking about worm casting. We've talked a little bit about worm castings for, uh, you know, making your soil better, for top dressing, dealing with, you know, different different things to get more uh, more goodness into your soil. And there was a question asked, how late into flower do you want to keep on up with that, uh, putting the top dressing on there? I thought it was a good question. I think it's a good answer. I'd like you to watch the clip. I'll talk to you. How late in flower would you utilize worm castings as a top dressing? What is the application rate if you have a medium gum deposit and uh, one half C worm this cast? Is one half a cup. One half a cup of worm castings per five gallon pot top. 48 cups of number four soil, a good start. Yeah, that's a great start. And they're really, the worm casting piece comes down to what's the worm castings and what's their food source. If mm. it's a high nitrogen manure food source, then you know I wouldn't go put that much on past week four because uh -huh. you're gonna be adding in a lot of nitrogen protein and sure. you know and soluble nitrates from mm. the, the castings themselves. So if it's like grain fed stuff, I mean week five, week six you'd be fine, but you're getting to a point where it's just getting yeah. late. But one half cup per four cups of soil as a top dress on top of the gum would be perfect. I mean okay. that's a great rate. And are you, uh, if you're going to reuse your soil, will that make any difference? Well, you might put some at the end to kind of get your soil ready for next time around, or not so much? I wouldn't in the last no. ten days because you, you're going to release a whole your... bunch of flavors that, right, gotcha. or nutrients that could tweak Perfect. the flavors at the very end. So, oh, okay. Now you really do, you want once you've chopped, then feel free to go ahead and top dress, put more fresh soil, and then start turning it because mm. it will start breaking everything down faster. But you certainly don't want to. There is nutrients to this, and you don't want to do that when you're trying to fall it out. Yeah, it's very minute, but it's enough. To me, that nitrogen is the key. I mean, worm castings historically will have nitrogen in them, and that would be my biggest concern for flavor. Okay. It'll green stuff up at the end of the... You won't go through fall either. I mean, you won't get a lot of uh, fade if you do that. Okay. What do you think of that? Informative? Entertaining? Helpful? Let me know in the comments, and also throw any other questions you have down there about uh, nectar, life, the universe, anything. We'll talk about them in the viewer questions episode. I love you. I'll see you tomorrow. The OCG Fam Show. It's pretty good. It happens every day. It's the OCG Fam Show. See you tomorrow.